<laughs> you doing it? Scat. Go away, scat. What on earth possessed him to learn to play the piano? Well, this is just a guess, but I think he loved that song you wrote. Maybe he wants to help you finish it. And I wrote that song when Petey was born. I called it the 151st Psalm, because I looked in the Bible, and out of the 150 Psalms, I couldn't seem to find one that thanked God enough for the joy I was feeling. But then things changed. And I can't think of a single reason to finish that song now. So are you sure you don't mind babysitting? I'm happy to. Okay. I don't know why I go to these PTA meetings. Bye, Mom. Okay, I've been going over this list, and I think we're doing pretty well. Number one is learn to play the piano. Well, that's a check. Okay. Snow shoveling. Mr. Morgan across the street said he'd be happy to shovel in this. Snow? Okay. Well, the church down at the corner said that Mom could come and sing with them anytime. And I've got a giant flagpole ordered. Oh, and I'm gonna make the flag. Just keep it in English, okay? Well, Mom wrote a letter to the insurance company. Okay, good. So that one's still pending. All right, that just leaves getting Mom to finish her song. I'm working on that. Okay. Then there's Find a Home for Fluffy. Mm, yuck. Let me think about that. Okay, well, that only leaves one more. Yeah. What? I'll be right here when you get back. Back from what? I still don't get it. Au revoir, baby. Careful. Big step, little step. All right. You got Come her? On. Yeah. Here we go. Hi. We have an appointment. This is Celine Casey, and this is her friend Petey. Keep going. Right. Okay, this is it, Celine. Your friend Petey has a gift for you. Andrew helped. Go ahead, knock. No, it's impossible. Nothing's impossible. Oh, oh my God! Ça me fait plaisir de vous rencontrer. Venez. Hello, how are you? Bonjour. So Celine, you like my music? She likes your everything. <laughs> Your music, your hair, your French. <laughs> Est-ce que tu parles un peu français? You all she ever talks about. I want to thank you for making the time to see us. I know that time is precious. Oh. Well, it is for everyone. So you know what? Tonight I'm going to sing a special song, but just for the two of you. Yeah. What? Which one? Well, it's a very special one, and I want you to listen to it very carefully. It's about living the very best you can through difficult times. Sometimes you don't get through. Well, honey, you always get through. You know, sometimes you come through the darkness back into the sunlight. And sometimes you come through into light itself. But whatever you do, I want you to keep your eyes on the light, okay? I love you. And I'm with you all the way. So sweet. And you, my big girl, you're so beautiful. <laughs> I want to give you this. I'm going to give you a little present. I want you to keep that in souvenir. All right. And I love you too.
So how did it go? Magnifique, incredible, super. My life is now complete. <laughs> How'd you do that anyway? Did you have to bribe somebody? Petey, there's a lot of generous people in this world. <laughs> Petey. <laughs> Petey. He's bleeding. Oh, come on, come on, come on. Come on, sweetie. Doctor says even if they moved him to the top of the list, that the chance of a transplant working now, there's so much damage. This is it, Monica. I'm gonna lose my baby. Not yet, Audrey. Not yet. 